From a dangerous fungus that creates zombie ant colonies to an epidemic of dangerous wild pigs and disease spreading bats, here are the 10 scariest creatures in the Amazon jungle. Number 10. The Vampire Fish The vampire fish is without a doubt one of the most horrifying creatures not only in the Amazon rainforest, but also in the entire world, or at least in the rivers of the world. This massive fish, properly known as a payara, makes its home in the Amazon basin. And yes, it has vampire teeth that are large enough and sharp enough to seriously do some damage to someone. If, for some ridiculous reason, one of these vampire fish managed to bite you in the neck, you probably wouldn't make it out of the water alive. Even a bite to your wrist or abdomen could prove fatal. The payara can grow to be 35 pounds and 3 feet long. It has powerful jagged jaws and two main teeth that stick out from its lower jaw, which it uses to basically spear its prey. But it has more teeth than that. There are a few smaller fangs in its face that it can use for impaling smaller fish, like Amazon Tetris. And if you think any of the photographs you see online of the massive vampire fish are exaggerated, it turns out that their fangs can actually grow to be upwards of 6 inches in length. The photos you've seen are definitely real. Number 9. Killer Fungi One of the freakiest creatures in the Amazon is not a creature at all, but a fungus. This may sound like the plot from a poorly budgeted horror movie, but there is actually a fungus in the Amazon jungle that can turn an insect into a zombie before it kills them. According to a report from the Daily Mail, this is a real parasite that is destroying colonies of ants in the South American rainforest. The fungus works by latching onto a carpenter ant while it scurries across the forest floor. The fungus then grows inside of the ant, consuming its entire body, draining nutrients and releasing mind control chemicals that alter its behavior. If you've ever seen the movie The Happening with Mark Wahlberg, it's kind of the same idea, but with insects and fungus. Scary! So, what does this parasitic zombie fungus do? It forces the ant to move around in as many areas as possible. The ant will find fresh leaves, it might climb up a tree and then jump off onto the leaves close to the ground, all in an attempt to spread the parasitic fungus as much as possible. The ant is basically a zombie whose only purpose is to infect the entire jungle. After the ant runs around trying to infect everything, the fungus will then force it to cripple itself, eventually resulting in its death. The spores of the fungus then bloom from the ant's head after it dies. Yeah, that is extremely terrifying, and hopefully no mad scientists try to take the fungus to other places in the world, only for it to leak and spread and cause a real-life zombie apocalypse. Number 8. Coral Snake There are lots of scary snakes in the Amazon jungle. Pretty much everywhere you look, there is a snake hidden somewhere in the dense green. And while the anaconda is certainly the biggest and most intimidating, there are actually nine species of coral snake located throughout Peru and much of the Amazon rainforest that are deadly, awful to look at, and absolutely horrifying. Coral snakes are very distinct. They are yellow, red, and black. They are clearly extremely venomous just by looking at them. Their venom is some of the strongest in the world. A single bite from a coral snake can kill a human in just a few minutes. These snakes can weigh up to 5 pounds and grow to be 3 feet in length. Coral snakes typically eat birds, lizards and frogs, but they have been known to cannibalize other snakes. And as a side note, it's important to know that when it comes to the red, yellow and black color scheme, if red touches yellow, the snake is deadly. However, if black touches red, the snake is not deadly. This is always a good thing to know when wandering into the jungle. There is a rhyme that goes, Red and yellow can kill a fellow. Red and black, friend of Jack. Number 7. Harpy Eagles Harpy Eagles are some of the most violent looking birds on the planet. The eagles of North America are majestic, and they are certainly deadly, but at least they don't look at all that horrifying. The Harpy Eagle looks like it's always plotting a gruesome murder. These are the most terrifying birds in the Amazon. They occupy massive territories and feed primarily on medium-sized mammals and other birds. It's the largest raptor in the jungle, and one of the biggest eagles on the planet. But despite the harpy eagle's large numbers, they can be difficult to spot. You'll probably never see one, even if you lived in the jungle your whole life. In terms of just how deadly these birds are, they share the very top of the food chain with the two other apex predators of the Amazon, the jaguar and the anaconda. The jaguar is the king of the forest floor, the anaconda is the ruler of the swamps, and the harpy eagle dominates the entire canopy of the Amazon rainforest. Their favorite meals consist of sloths and monkeys. Number 6. Giant Fishing Spider Sure, there are plenty of venomous and scary spiders in the Amazon. There's the Goliath Bird Eater, which is exactly what it sounds like. There's a spider the size of a dog, and there are countless tarantulas. 
But one of the most overlooked arachnids is the giant fishing spider, which is horrifying in its own way. The spider is huge, growing to be around 1.5 to 4 centimeters, and they eat a diet primarily of fish and other swampy amphibians. You can find these eight-legged freaks waiting by the side of rivers and streams to pounce on unsuspecting prey. They are even able to coat themselves in an air bubble and dive underwater to ambush off-guard fish. The giant fishing spider is able to dive under the water and swim for several minutes at a time until it finds a fish and feels like eating. Imagine going for a dip and coming out with a huge, hairy spider stuck to your chest and it's holding onto a small fish with its massive fangs. This is a disturbing picture and not something you want happening. Number 5. The Giant Leech Another aquatic freak show of the Amazon jungle is the giant Amazonian leech. Scientists believe it is the largest freshwater leech in the world. It can grow to be almost 20 inches in length with an astounding width of almost 4 inches. That means the leech can be half as long as your arm. They live inside the Amazon River, all the way from Venezuela to the Guianas. And while most people think leeches just hang around in the water waiting to eat people, their main diet consists of caimans, massive anacondas, capybaras and even cows. Leeches are excellent swimmers and will hang out under rocks in the water while they digest whatever meal they ate. They have no problem sucking onto any life form silly enough to get in the water, including you. If you thought getting out of the water with the fishing spider on you was bad, how loud would you scream if this giant leech was on you and sucking your blood? Number 4. Red-bellied piranha As we recently learned from the last two numbers, there are plenty of things in the waters of the Amazon to be scared of. But even before someone arrives in the Amazon jungle, chances are they're already scared of the red-bellied piranha. These fish have one of the most notorious reputations of any animal in the world. But did you know that piranhas are actually important scavengers and a critical part of the Amazon ecosystem? According to the National Zoo, a huge part of their diet consists of fins which they nibble off the larger fish. A typical red-bellied piranha can weigh about 4 pounds and grow to be over 1 foot long and they travel in large schools. But it's nothing like what you see in the movies. You'll never actually see 500 piranhas devouring a cow in a mad feeding frenzy within just 30 seconds. Usually, there are no more than 20 individual piranhas in a school. They are still vicious predators and they will bite you, but there's absolutely no chance that a small school of 20 piranhas can literally rip the skin from your bones as if you were thrown into a blender. You definitely don't want to be attacked by one, but they aren't quite as horrifying as everyone thinks. Number 3. Lance Head Pit Viper Pit vipers are not friendly. These are snakes that you should 100% be terrified of. They are what nightmares are made of. And while I could go on and on about how the Amazonian Lancehead Pit Viper has venom poisonous enough to kill a person in minutes, let's talk instead about the deadly snake island in Brazil, where hordes of Lancehead Pit Vipers have caused the island to be blocked off from any human contact. It's known as Snake Island, and it's located 90 miles from Sao Paulo. According to just about every news source across the world, it is the deadliest island on the planet, and it earns the title because it has the highest concentration of venomous snakes anywhere in the world. On this island, there is an insane amount of golden lancehead vipers, which are one of the most venomous vipers on the planet. But what's crazy about the island of the snakes is that the lancehead vipers that live here are said to have three to five times stronger venom than those that live on the mainland in the jungle. A single bite can melt human flesh and leads to death within the hour. There are about 4,000 of these snakes on the island, and it's the only place in the world where golden lancehead vipers are found. But of course, there are still normal lancehead vipers on the mainland. Number 2. Feral Pigs These aren't your normal cute little piggies. Feral pigs are dangerous and should be considered scary by everyone. What's really interesting about feral pigs, also known as javelinas or peccary, is that they live all the way from Arizona to the jungles of the Amazon. You can find them in the jungle, you can find them in Texas, and you can find them all throughout Central America as well. And even though these are a type of pig, they don't look or behave like the pigs you might be thinking of. A perfect example of this is when a man and his dog were attacked by a pack of feral pigs in Arizona. It happened at the top of a mountain, and according to the Phoenix Fire Department, the hiker was forced to call 911 after the feral pigs came out of nowhere and basically tried to eat the man and his dog for breakfast. Sounds more like a pack of hungry wolves than pigs. And even though these feral monsters can be found in Arizona, they do stem from South America. They have very slowly made their way north and are now prevalent throughout most of the Americas. Fun fact, these feral pigs are most closely related to hippopotamuses. Number 1. Vampire Bats and Disease The scariest animal by far in the Amazon is the vampire bat. 
Not only because these bats turn into actual vampires and suck people's blood at night, but because under the right circumstances, vampire bats from the Amazon, specifically from Brazil, could unleash extremely deadly diseases across the globe. A new study has shown that feral pigs, the kind we just spoke about in the last story, have increased in population five times since 2007. The population explosion of the pigs has led to a population explosion of vampire bats. More blood to drink, more bats to drink it. This has pushed the possibility of a new infectious disease being born through the vampire bats to a staggering level. This study was published in the journal Frontiers in Ecology and the Environment, and it's a harsh warning. With an exponentially increasing population of vampire bats, the most disease-ridden animals on the planet, there's more possibility that they spread disease to livestock, humans, and even the globe. Which of these animals are you most afraid of? Do you think Amazonian vampire bats will create the next big disease? Let me know your thoughts in the comments, and thank you for watching. Come back soon for another great video, and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.